Okay, right now we are in Waimea at the uh, ground station for the WM Keck Observatory. Just to uh, give you guys a reference of where we are, uh, Hilo is about 65 miles to the east of us. Um, Kona is about 45 miles to the west. And the summit of Mauna Kea is about 10 or 15 miles to the south of us. So uh, we're gonna go inside and check it out. Okay, this is the uh, main entrance. Just gonna take a quick walk inside. Hi. Excuse me, who are you with? <laughs> I'm from the University of Toronto. Who are you with? I'm with Keck Observatory. Oh, yeah? Are you here to visit? Uh, no, I'm a professional astronomer. I'm kidding, yeah, I'm visiting. So. <laughs> <laughs> Can I see your press pass? <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, uh, I was just inside and uh, said that if I want to interview with someone, I have to wait an hour or so. Instead of calling them, I'm just going to chill out here. It's uh, not that much stuff you can look at, even though American taxpayers fund this whole thing. The public does have a lot of restrictions, so... Hopefully we could get some good news about the uh, first light from the extra solar planets that WMCAC and uh, Hubble got. I was on NBC this morning. Um, hopefully they gave me a real astronomer and not some PR guy and we'll get some good shots. Okay, we are leaving the observatory right now. Apparently there's no astronomers available or it's gotta be on an interview or some crap like that, but... Okay, here I am at the uh, NASA Infrared Telescope. It's, uh, it's kind of a smaller one. It's right next to the WM Keck. And it's lower ground than the Canada France Hawaii telescope. There she is right up there. There's the sun. Yeah, there there it is on higher ground right there. Canada France Hawaii. There was Gemini that we just went to. And above me is the infrared space telescope. Here we are at the WM Keck. Finally, seeing all these other telescopes. It's actually got a visitor entrance, which is great. So it looks like we're going inside now. Hopefully, we meet some professional astronomers, finally. History of the WM Keck Foundation. I think it was his millions that saved this telescope. Ah, oh, there we go. This is our short film again. I guess this is the layout the telescope, all those hexagonal mirrors to make up the 10 meters. We're at our final telescope for today, which is the Subaru. It's a gigantic scope. And that's all we're going to do for today.